Alrighty, huh. I'm exhausted. This is the Don McGannon Clubhouse. And this is one of the places that I have donated. It's the Boys and Girls Club. And Mom and I are exhausted. So I've gone to ugh, my grandson's school, donated there. And now I've donated here and I've got one more community center to donate. All right, let's go. Hi everyone, Grey Power 60 here. So we went shopping today and uh, had to pick up a few things. So we went to Metro to pick up a few food items. Of course, we always buy our three bags of milk. I get 2% for mom and me. Put it in the fridge. Oh. While I was there, there was some free magazines. I don't know why I got the Ferrent one. I thought maybe there might be cool pictures in there I might use. Oh, I picked up too many. Okay. Uh, 55 plus. I always like to read that once in a while. And this one is, I don't know this one, is Faces. Maybe it's people in the city. I'm not sure. Well, yep. So that... <laughs> And then I picked up some extra lean ground beef. And for this big container, it was $8.92. Just thought you'd be interested in some of the prices. Some of the prices if I know them. I think the hot dogs were four something. These are the maple leaf top dogs. I think they were four, four ninety-seven, four something. I don't know if you're interested or not. Hot dogs, $4.99. And then, of course, I always get some thinly sliced ham. Old-fashioned ham for mum was $3.24. And this is um, coleslaw. It's the um, really fine stuff. It's the stuff that... Um, um, Kentucky Fried Chicken used to have, but they don't anymore. So anyway, that's one of mom's favorites. And then I also picked up a Nest, Nesquik, Nestle's Nesquik. It's a liquid chocolate. I, um, I like to have a chocolate milk once in a while. And uh, sometimes um, mom has ice cream and I sprinkle a little bit. The lighting in here is bad. I'm so sorry. Should have brought my other light in here. Let me see if I can get it. All right, let's see if that's any better. So I'm just going to put these quickly in the fridge because I don't like to leave things out. There we go. Now, I ordered from Amazon and I'm hoping it'll be what I hope it will be and I hope I'm not disappointed here's the little oh look at that it's even got a chain with it it's kind of cool let's see these are little charms little Christmas charms Oh, it just comes with some O-rings. So let's see. We got a Christmas tree, a gingerbread man, another tree, snowman, another tree. I'm just gonna show you these in a second. A mitten, Santa. There's supposed to be a hundred hundred and some pieces, but I thought these would be great for dangles for Christmas or just about anything. There's a bell and a star. I know I'm not showing it to you, but um, there's just so many in here. Little hat. So let me show you here. 
Aren't they adorable? Oops, sorry, I moved the little bell. And that's only some of them. There's some in here that are Santas. Little Santas, Christmas tree, silver bells. Just so many cute ones. I'm so pleased that I picked this up. Here's a reindeer. Another snowman, another mitten. Aren't they adorable? So I am really, really pleased that they arrived. And they also had some O-rings in there, and that would be great. I have lots. I have tons. So I am so pleased that that arrived today. Now, let me show you what I got at Dollarama. Here's a big bag. There's not that much in it, but I want to wrap up um, my son and my daughter-in-law, my daughter and her husband. I want to wrap up their gifts and give it to them right away and get it out of the house. And uh, I think chances are the boys are going to want uh, gift cards from what I understand. So... I just got these two. I had lots, but I gave them all to my son last year. Okay. Next, I saw this. They were all kind of bent in the corner, but I saw this designer paper. I thought it was so cute, and I flipped through. So we'll just flip through really quickly. Aren't they adorable? I just love this paper. I don't need paper, but I love this Christmas paper. And because it had the, of course, the um, gnomes on it. So all that you see in here is all that you have inside. And they're shiny, some foil ones. So I think it was four, four twenty-five for that thing. A few years ago, I had picked it up one of these clear containers to put a gift in and this year i was going to only get one but there was green and the kind of the gray silver so i picked up those three i didn't have a cart with me so everything was in my arms i also picked up these pretty doilies the bigger ones had hi mom I'm just filming. The bigger ones had candy canes and they didn't have any in the small, which was kind of disappointing. Don't ask me why. I picked up this book. It's called The Cat Who Didn't Like Christmas. And I thought this would be... Okay, Mom, you're going to go watch your show. Okay. So I thought that might be a cute read one day. Then I saw these cute stickers. Aren't these adorable? Let me go up. I just thought these were really sweet. Great for uh, toppers or for decorating. If I'm doing flip books, etc., etc. And then I saw these cute tags. And they're in the shape of little coffee. And it just says Merry Christmas to and from on it. So I picked up two because I thought they were just so cute. Whether I use them or not is another story. And the rest is candy stuff. I like to pick up um, these ones. These are a dollar. There's not very many in it. I should have checked to make sure there was no hole. <laughs> anyway, I like to um, put some in the uh, dish downstairs. And also, and if I'm going to be making hot cocoa packs or gifts i like to throw in a piece of chocolate and then i picked up these peppermint patties i like those and the last thing i picked up were these christmas noel mix and again it's the same as the ones i picked up the other day these are the um, chocolate mixes with the santas and the bells and the circles and that is my haul. I always go too fast on my hauls, way too fast.
But that is what I did today. And I also delivered um, a lot of boxes to the school. A lot, I donated a lot of those wooden pieces in boxes. So a third of them have gone to the school. A third of them have gone to the Boys and Girls Club. They absolutely loved everything. Um, they were concerned when I said wood that there was sharp edges for kids, but there's not. They are all, they're all so sweet. So he was so thrilled and he said the kids are going to love that, especially when they start doing Christmas things. So uh, I was pleased that they were going to be using those. And I have one more community center to drop things off. And then that is it. And then I can start doing crafting. And oh, and I have to drop off at my daughter-in-law's. Um, the um, backpacks for the three girls and the three boys. And the other bags, Christmas bags for the uh, men or women, whoever it may be, that might need few extra things so I'm curious to read this book the cat who didn't like Christmas I may even read it to you guys <laughs> why not it was 250 oh my gosh Dollarama is always expensive I should I get more stuff at Dollarama but you pay for it and then of course these big bags I keep them for when we do groceries so I've got that one, and I've got this smaller one from Metro, which is where I buy all of my groceries normally. Sometimes I'll go to Walmart, and sometimes I'll go to Giant Tiger. But for meat and things, I go to Metro, because I prefer their meat. Anyway, guys, that is it for me for today. Thanks for joining me, and I hope you enjoyed the haul. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. It helps my channel. I'm trying to get it to start growing again because it's kind of stagnant. I love all of my members that I, members, my subbies, my friends. I love all you guys. You are so sweet for leaving comments. And when I bring mom along, I didn't videotape mom today. I should have, um, or did I? I don't remember. Cause I know I did videotape the outside of the boys and girls club and uh, I may have taken a quick, quick thing of mum, but we shall see. Anyway, guys, thanks for joining me, and we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.